The Commission to Investigate Allegations of Bribery or Corruption recorded a statement from the former mayor of Kote, Janakaranavaka, today with regard to a complaint he has lodged against Minister Malik Samaravikrama. The former mayor of Kote lodged a complaint with the Bribery Commission against Minister Samaru Vikrama on the 7th of February this year, revealing an illegal acquisition of land, causing a massive loss to the government. After giving his statement to the commission, the former mayor spoke to the media. According to the government valuer, the value of this land in August 2013 was 180 million rupees. So since there wasn't a road to go to this land, the chairman of the Road Development Authority forcefully acquired eight purchases of land belonging to the Kota Municipal Council to build a road. This caused a loss of 40 million rupees to the Kota Municipal Council. The value of this land in 2013 was 220 million, much more than what it is now. So Minister Malik Samara Vikram is enjoying the benefits of this 220 million rupee land which he has forcefully acquired. I call on the Bribery Commission today to initiate legal action against Minister Malik Samara Vikrama, the Chairman of the Urban Development Authority and the Commissioner of the Kota Municipal Council. If Malik Samara Vikrama can forcefully acquire a state-owned land and get away with it, what more needs to be said about the general public of the country? If the law is being properly enacted, it should be implemented from top to bottom, regardless of the status of the thief. Why isn't anything being done against Malik Samara Vikrama? Is he God? Malik Samara Vikram is not the country's president nor prime minister. This 220 million rupee fraud is lying at plain sight.